Hey everybody, John here. Today I want to give you my honest review of Go High Level in 2024 after having been in digital marketing for about 20 years and using just about every other marketing system on the planet. Here's what I honestly can say is good and bad about Go High Level. We're going to cover the basics like what high level is and why it's different from some of the competition, the pricing, the features, but I'm going to get more detailed on the things I love and I dislike about the platform and really who it's for so that by the end of the video, you'll know if you're a perfect fit for it or not. And at the end of the video, I'm going to show you the best and fastest way to learn the platform from scratch coming from me who had to learn it less than a year ago. And in the last six months, I've launched my own six figure software business using the high level platform. So if that sounds good, let's go ahead and dive in. So High Level primarily is an all-in-one business and marketing tool, which doesn't mean a whole lot to anybody because it's just like big words, but it's designed originally for agencies to be able to take this software and go serve local businesses like plumbers, electricians, chiropractors, restaurant owners, things like that to improve their sales and marketing. And they have a massive uh, amount of social proof here. They have over 60,000 customers who are serving over 1.4 million businesses. So why is that? Why are those numbers different? Why are customers different than businesses? because a customer for high level could be an individual business, a one person using the software for themselves. It could be, but that is the minority. What the real value proposition is for high level is one customer could be an agency and that one agency could have their own, let's say a hundred different businesses. Maybe this agency focuses on plumbers. And so they have a hundred different plumbers in their local area or across the country, and they're helping plumbers really hone in on their digital marketing skills. So that's why you can have a smaller number of customers and yet serve a ton of businesses. What's really cool about High Level is when you join in as an agency, you can pay one subscription fee, but have access to as many accounts. You can serve as many businesses as you want at no additional cost. So if you scroll on down to the bottom of their homepage here, you can see there's two plans published here. I'll talk about a third one in a second, um, where the starter is if you just want to do it for yourself, that's $97 a month, but it really is a no brainer to go for at least the second plan, which is 297, because you can do all the features, which is on this ridiculous chart here of all the different features you can do, but you can do it for as many businesses as you want to. And it's as easy as clicking a few buttons and you have a brand new business built out already formatted. What I love about the pricing here is that they really are trying to help you. They don't have these ridiculous gotchas built into the platform. Other softwares might give you a free plan, but it just doesn't work or you can't do half of anything until you upgrade to a bigger plan. Here, even from the starter plan, yes, it's $97 per month, but it lets you do everything you want inside of that those business accounts. Before we move off of pricing, there is one additional plan. This is the plan that I am personally on. It is $500 a month, $497, and it's called SaaS Pro. SaaS is software as a service. This is where things get really interesting and really different from other areas in the software space. High Level is not a marketing company. They're not trying to really build their own audience. They're trying to find people like you and me who say, hey, I can do this for you. I can go and find my own niche in the audience and I'm gonna take High Level and I'm gonna call it my own software. You know, for example, ours is called Freedom Kit. And so we help people that has our own audience and we white label Go High Level and we sell it to our audience because one, they have more trust in us than they might have in a high level platform. It allows you to focus in and customize and let your platform from do what you want it to do, take away features you don't want them to do, gives you a ton of control. And the best part is most softwares like this would give you a percentage of the sales. Let's say you are an affiliate for a software, you might get 30% or so of the revenue. Here, you get 100% of the revenue when you go for the software as a service plan. It's been absolutely game changing for me. We have over a thousand paying software users on our platform. And I can tell you, it makes the experience of running a software company so easy. And it really gives that different level of significance of what you do versus just being an affiliate for a product or anything like that. When you get into high level and you find an audience that you want to serve, you can go, you can go hard and serve that audience and help help them and go high level really makes that possible and is really fantastic. As for the feature set, there's too much honestly to cover. I'm here on the dashboard of a demo account and every single one of these buttons is not the only feature. If I click on marketing, for example, because this is a sales and marketing platform, inside of this just one feature of marketing, you've got social media marketing where you can schedule all of your social posts across all your different platforms. You've got email marketing, including email automation, drag and drop automations. You can do trigger links like Bitly type of stuff. You can have your own affiliate program. You can run social media ads like Facebook and Instagram ads directly from the platform. And you can even create and manage your own multiple brands. 
And of course, a sales and marketing platform is not complete without having a beautiful website, but websites come in different shapes and sizes. So high level completely supports that you can run funnels like click funnels, websites like WordPress, you can even actually host WordPress inside go high level. Uh, guys, uh, you can do blogs, e commerce stores, create your own pop up forms, surveys, chat widgets, all kinds of things. The point here, the key point is, this is an all in one, <laughs> like when you sign up with go high level, you don't need convert kit, you don't need active campaign, you don't need click funnels, you don't need Kartra, you don't need WordPress, you don't need uh, Etsy. So it is a really a different animal. Um, they've even added some additional features recently of having your own communities and courses. So you can also cancel teachable, you can cancel circle.so or school, anything like that. It's pretty interesting and very unique to be able to take so many features and bring them into one place. There are there's a good thing and a bad thing. I guess I'll segue into what I love and what I don't love. Um, so this platform is for those who are tired of losing their passwords for all their different services. They're tired of if they maybe have a client and they don't know what tool stack they're using, they have to learn all these different tool stacks. Like a few years ago when I started a different web design agency, I would have to learn everything and I was tired of it. Now with a high level, you can simply say, oh, you have something that's great. I'm going to build you something better. It's going to be cheaper. It's going to be faster. It's going to be more integrated and I'll do it for you. And so you can actually do what's considered to be more work, like rebuilding a business, but you can do it with the snapshot feature, which allows you in a couple of clicks to build in an entire business model for somebody inside high level at no additional cost. Let me show you that right now. So let's say I meet a new automotive uh, dealer here, since I'm just here in the front of the, the page, and they already have a website, but it's kind of clunky. They can't figure out who their web guy was. They don't have the password. Like that's how most of these clients are. And you're like, hey, that's great. How about this? At no additional cost, I'm gonna give you a website for free just to try us out. And we'll also set up email marketing and text message marketing for you. A free 30 day trial, what do you say? Anybody would say yes to that because nobody can find access to their websites. It's just a thing. It's terrible. Trust me, I've done this for years and it is the most annoying part of the entire process. So here what you can do is you can simply click on a snapshot and this is going to bring in websites, a sales funnel, a free offer, email uh, templates, custom automations already done for you and geared for a specific industry. And you might be thinking, well, how likely is it that I'm going to have an auto dealer? Well, it's not just auto dealer, career coaches, chiropractors, business coaching, bookkeepers, content creators, day spas, defense lawyers, all that. The point is, this is a game changer from having to spin up a brand new WordPress website and then get hosting figured out, get logged in, get all the credentials. No, it's all inside this one place. And when you have multiple clients, it's as easy. And let's say you wanted to manage clients because that's a great way to make a bunch of money up front. You can just scroll through. These are all of our users and we can just scroll through and click in and manage somebody's account with no muss or fuss. So I've shared a lot of great stuff about high level, but who should avoid high level? And take this with a grain of salt. In my opinion, you should avoid high level if you don't want to build a real business. Now, what do I mean by a real business? If you want to get like some sort of a get rich quick scheme where it's like click this link and make money, high level is not for you because you actually need to handle everything from attracting new customers marketing and converting them into you know into sales delivering on your promises and collecting cash and managing that relationship that is the acdc model of building a real business and high level facilitates every step of that but there are those people out there that sometimes get you know hacked into thinking that they can just go onto twitter and retweet a certain post and have a link and make a bunch of money from that and that is simply not a sustainable business model. Those types of get rich quick schemes, they just don't work very well. <laughs> Go high, they don't work very well at all, period. Uh, but using a platform like Go High Level, you're gonna get into it and you realize, oh, I need to do things like manage my email address, which is a business thing. And so none of it is really hard. It's just, it is real. And so high level helps you build a real business. And obviously that is a pro, but there's a large number of people that will denounce or speak negatively about high level because they don't wanna do the work. And so uh, where you do have support every step of the way, you've got 24 seven chat support, live Zoom support, I can give you support as well, which we'll talk about at the end of the video. Um, there is a ton of ways to be successful with high level, but it does take work and it does take learning the skills of building a real business. And I just wanna make sure you're aware of that before we go too far and you think like, oh, I'm just gonna click a button and make money, not gonna happen.
personally, I love high level. They have so many features and they're coming out with features all the time. It makes it easier and more fun to use, more fun to sell, more fun to support because it's constantly growing. I've been on software platforms where they would make big promises and you wouldn't see anything come from those promises. High level is very different. In fact, they kind of under promise and over deliver. They're kicking out new features every day and they're giving it to you one of my habits has been to wake up in the morning, go check out the change log and see all the new fun things that I get to explore and then sell to my customers. It is a fantastic thing. So the speed of development is a great thing, but it also does lead into probably the biggest downside is that because high level does advance so quickly and kicks out a bunch of features, you don't exactly know which ones are ready for prime time unless you test it. So it is one of those things where if you are not an advanced user, that's okay. You can absolutely do successful with high level. Just don't go into a little area I'm gonna show you right now where you can go into the labs and it says new. This is where all the weird stuff comes out and you'll never go in here and see it empty. They are always releasing new stuff. But the big thing is, if you are not a power user and you don't want to mess anything up, don't turn on new stuff until it goes live. You can see it's going to go live at a certain point, at which point all the bugs will be worked out. Uh, but it's one of those things where they definitely follow that skateboard model of they start with something very quickly, get feedback, and iterate, which is good for software. But if you do have a business, for example, with over a thousand software users, or we have over a hundred thousand people who have used some of our trainings and courses over time, uh, you can definitely um, uh, mess some things up if you don't fully understand how it works before you get started. So at the end of the day, I love high level. I think it's great for almost anybody. If you want to get started online and start making money online without having to be chained to your desk, this is a fantastic business model. And I do, I worked out with the team to be able to increase the trial. You can get a free trial for 14 days at gohighlevel.com. I've gotten you a 30 day free trial. If you go to sofreedom.com and sign up for my free training, I'm going to show you how to, how I set up the software side. We'll also give you a ton of scripts and training and all kinds of goodies, as well as live support where you can ask me questions personally about your software business, about selling, about the technical aspect, anything like that. Just head over to sofreedom.com, sign up for the free training, and I cannot wait to see what you think about high level and the training as well. Uh, please leave me a comment down below what you think about high level. Do you think they kick out features too fast? Do you think it's uh, priced right? I'm curious. Let's have a conversation. After using WordPress and ClickFunnels and Kartra and so many platforms that kind of come and go the way of the dinosaur, um, I think this one is different. And the reason is because they are absolutely developers first and every other software that I can remember have been marketers first, not developers first. So I'm super thrilled working with High Level. I've talked personally with the CEO and I just I'm here to stay. And so my software company is built on it. These are the reasons why. Um, hope you like this video. This is kind of more raw talking to you. And I'll see you in the next one. Take care.